Hi everyone, it's Stephanie from Quilt Addicts Anonymous. I hope you guys are having a good, well, as good as you can Thanksgiving. This year it has been one wild ride, 2020. Uh, it started out with me having a baby and it was a miracle baby. It was after five years of trying to get pregnant and not being able to. So that was a really great high. It was fabulous and to be able to have her at last, to have that baby that we had wanted for so long. And then uh, I had a about six weeks where I wasn't allowed to leave the house because I had an emergency c-section and then I had maybe two weeks of freedom and then the everything locked down and so we have been I've been pretty much in my house almost the entire year it's been pretty crazy uh, here and and then of course at our shop and it's just been one wild ride, I think, for everybody. And now is a good time to sit and be thankful. Unfortunately, we can't get together with our family this year because it's not safe, uh, but we're gonna be doing some Zoom pumpkin pie, which is not the same, but thank God we have all this technology to where we can still feel connected even though we're so far apart. And so I'll be making uh, Thanksgiving dinner for my family, which, which isn't too unusual for us. We typically uh, don't travel for Thanksgiving because it was usually so busy with getting stuff out for the shop but uh, it definitely is unusual to not see any family and that's sad and and we're we're definitely sad about that but we also want to be thankful for the things that we do have we've got our we've got our home we've got our family we have this baby that we have longed for for so long we are grateful to all of you for supporting us this year and for ordering your supplies from us online and we're able to ship that out to you. We're also grateful that we were able to completely close our brick and mortar store and that you guys online have filled in that gap. Um, that way we don't have to expose ourselves at all. We run an additional space so that our fulfillment team can each have their own office to work in and that way we are limiting the number of staff that are being in. So I know it's taking a little bit longer to get things out but we're able to do it in a way that's super safe for our team as safe as we can be anyway and um, that we're able to continue to provide jobs and to be able to keep our family going during this time and that we're able to provide good distractions for you guys and mass supplies so that way you can keep yourselves your families and your communities safe so with that, one of the things that we do this year is we always come up with a really big deal for Black Friday. And this year, we're going to be doing a special deal on some of my patterns. Now, a lot of you guys have been ordering our patterns for PDF download instead of our paper patterns. So they've just, they've not been getting as much love. So what we decided to do was do a massive, big bundle deal. So you can get seven of the Quilt Addicts Anonymous patterns for $19.99. Normally these things are $12 a piece, but we're gonna make seven for $19.99. Now we don't have, these are ones that we've had around for a little bit, so we don't have the same number of every single one. So we have about 250 packs of seven, and then once those are gone, they're gonna be six in a pack and five, and then down to two until we have them all gone. And we'll be adjusting the price as we go. So if you see this and you can on there and they're like wait there's only two left it's because you're at the tail end and some people beat you to the deal but the price will be reflected every time we drop a pattern I'm gonna go through them real quick here and then you guys can go check that out. We will have some more Black Friday deals for you later in the week, starting on Thanksgiving. So keep an eye out, make sure you're subscribed over at shop.quiltnextanonymous.com. But I'm gonna real quick go through these patterns for you and we'll show some images of the quilts as well so that way you guys can see a little bit closer look at them. 1870, this one, uh, is a real good one if you are a long armor or if you uh, like to give your long armor a nice little gift. There is a lot of negative space in this one and I designed it because I got this voile which I thought was so pretty. This was legitimately the first fabric I ever ordered on Bolt and I it was really pretty but it was kind of expensive. Um, it Voile is more expensive typically than quilting cotton and so I wanted to give people an idea of what they could do with just half a yard and we were able to get this panel and then the pillow 
close and then have your background. And this was probably one of the most expensive quilts I did because I also purchased Oscar de la Renta linen for the background on this. You don't have to go that crazy, of course. Um, but this is a real good one to use up when you just have a, a few fabrics that you wanna do and you wanna have a lot of negative space. Charm Squared, this was one of our most popular patterns of all time. It's made using two charm packs, hence the name Charm Squared. And then you have some background yardage. It's super easy, super fast to do. So a great way to use up those charm packs that we collect. In this one, um, I've always used two of the same, but if you have a designer that you like, like say you've got a couple of cape and a couple of tuba charm packs that you want to use up, you can mix and match and that'll look really cute together. Hanging Garden. I always felt like this one was underrated. I worked with Shel Rummel to create this one and it is a paper piece pattern and it is really fun, really cute uh, way to fussy cut and really show off some cute little things. This is done as a wall hanging, but you could also turn it on the side if you're fussy cutting and you could have it uh, be a, a runner as well and have your little fussy cut pieces facing both directions. I redid this as a uh, a uh, little mug rug too when I was teaching a class on paper piecing. Looks totally different, so just don't, if you're, these soft colors aren't for you, no big deal. There are, are many ways to make a pattern come to life. Hillside, this is also one of our most popular ones of all time. This one takes two uh, jelly rolls and it looks a lot harder than it is. We are just going to slice off a corner of one of those and then you're gonna stagger piece them. So you're able to cut this as one big strip piece bit and it is so fun. So two jelly rolls and a hillside pattern and you have a lap quilt that is just one big riot of color and is a lot of fun. Strip and Mini, I teamed up with Leah Day on this. I met her at Quilt Market many years ago and she was doing some collaboration patterns. So I did the quilting on this and she, or I did the piecing and she did the quilting on it. She's got a video on how she quilted it on her channel. Uh, we'll link to all these videos, by the way, the ones that have video tutorials, which I think is all but 1870 and this one was so fun to do because she challenged me to create something that was less than 14 inches square. So I believe this ended up being about 11 and a half inches square. Um, this is, I'll turn it over, you can see what it actually looked like. That's so tiny, um, but it's your piece. So it's not as crazy as it looks. And then you can watch her tutorial on how to quilt that as well. Trending up, uh, this one I designed to go with a line with QT fabrics, but I've actually seen it done in some other stuff and it the scrapper you make it the more fun it gets because you can really have some fun with this line going up um, but that really works well uh, that one is that one works with yardage so that one is a fun one to do as well wildflower meadow so a long time ago uh, we before I had a store we used to do fabric exchanges to make scrappy quilts and so this was one of the ones that we did with that and I would you guys would send in fabric that was pre-cut and then I would sort it all and then I would ship it back out with your background that you needed. And uh, we did one uh, that was patriotic and it broke me, it was too many pieces. And, and unfortunately not everybody cuts the same. So I felt a little bad sending some of the fabrics out because we had some that were like perfectly cut and some where they were like, I don't know if people use scissors or what, but it was like not, it was not cut right. And so uh, that was the last one we did, but these are really fun because you take about two different colorways and you make it work. And this one, it was one of my favorites. Um, and I love it because the flying geese are on half of it. And so on half of the border, so it just frames it out nicely. And that negative space in that border really helps call attention to the really fun, uh, flying geese in there without like making you totally insane because it's so many flying geese. So that one has been a popular pattern for us as well. So I hope you enjoy these patterns. Again, if you get on this deal right away, you can get all seven for $19.99. Once we start to run out of the paper patterns, it'll be six to a pack and then we'll reduce accordingly all the way down to two. And uh, at the end of this, our goal is to have very few paper patterns left. We'll have a few um, if you prefer that, but uh, for the most part, we, we want to mostly do PDFs because that seems to be what you guys are preferring. So take advantage of this. This is a great deal. It is like uh, almost 75% off. I think a little bit more than 75% off because typically these would be $12 a piece. I think that's 84 bucks for a value. And we are going to be selling these for $19.99 if you're able to get in when they are all seven. So check it out. It's over at shop.quilt 
thatexonomist.com. The deal will be up until it is gone. The last time we did something like this, I thought it would take the weekend to sell out and it was gone literally in a day, in hours. It was insane. So jump on that, go grab it. And thank you so much. I hope that you guys are able to make the most of this Thanksgiving. Even if you aren't able to spend it with your family, get on and do some Zoom pumpkin pie like we're gonna do. It's not awesome. But hey, it's 2020, we're gonna make the best of it and we're gonna be grateful for the things that we do have and the fact that we're able to live in an age where we do have this technology available to us and we can connect with each other online, you can learn a quilt online from us and you can have some Zoom pumpkin pie with your family. So I hope you have a happy Thanksgiving. I hope you're able to make the best of it and we will get through this and it will be better next year. Thanks so much and happy quilting. Never bothered about what could be coming Every day we danced a life